Hello everyone. So today we are going to discuss Kanizaro reaction. So uh, what are Kanizaro reactions? Aldehydes having no alpha hydrogen atom in presence of a strong alkali, for example NaOH, KOH, give disrepro disproportionation reaction in which one molecule of aldehyde is reduced into primary alcohol and another molecule of the same aldehyde is oxidized into sodium or potassium salt of carboxylic acid and this reaction is known as Canizaro reaction. If the reaction is carried out with two different aldehydes having no alpha hydrogen atom it is called crossed Canizaro reaction. If both the aldehyde groups having no alpha hydrogen are in the same molecule that is called intramolecular or internal Canizaro reaction. So uh, here you can see this is benzaldehyde, two moles, two molecules of benzaldehyde in presence of alkali, strong alkali like NaOH. So uh, one molecule is being reduced to alcohol and another molecule is being oxidized into carboxylic acid so because medium is alkaline so it we will get the sodium salt of benzoic acid so this is the example of canizaro reaction and what are the disp disproportionation reaction disproportionation reaction are those reactions in which the one molecule is reduced and the another molecule of the same compound is oxidized so when the this is called uh, self uh, redux reduction and oxidation reaction so this is this disproportionation reaction now the mechanism of canizaro reaction and for mechanism we are taking here this is benzaldehyde ph cho and this in presence of alkali this step is fast reversible step so this uh, this nucleophile came from uh, NaOH that will ionize and will give Na plus and OH negative and this OH negative will act as a nucleophile and because this is a polar bond this will this is always polarized this is slightly positive charge slightly negative charge and sometimes due to uh, electromagnetic effect this gives the full charge negative full charge positive so here this there is positive charge at carbonyl carbon so this is nucleophilic center and this nucleophile will attack at this nucleophilic center and this will go this uh, boarding pair of electron will go to the oxygen which is more electronegative so we will get ph c o negative h o h and this oxy anion we are getting here now because this is O negative so this its effect is this will uh, this can provide electron to the carbon towards carbon so a carbon will be comparatively electron rich because of this oxygen uh, this plus I effect of this oxygen and this and uh, this hydride now this can be easily transferred uh, so in the next step that is the irreversible step the second molecule of aldehyde this hydride will be transferred to the second molecule of the aldehyde having no alpha hydrogen so here this will be ph co oh and we will get here ph co negative and h and here also H. So uh, this is a benzoic acid and this is uh, like like uh, this is uh, you can say this is benzyl oxide ion and here this is unstable this is highly reactive so this will get proton from here because this is acidic this can provide proton and next this is again this is slow step the middle one this is again fast step and this is proton exchange 
proton exchange so here we will get the carboxylate ion and alcohol this will be ch2 and oh so this is benzyl alcohol benzyl alcohol and this is uh, benzoate benzoate because medium is alkaline so this will be the benzoate ion so this will form the sodium benzoate so this is the mechanism basically of the Canizaro reaction and here uh, this is uh, one oxygen oxyanion and sometimes what happens uh, this oxyanion sometimes gives uh, suppose that if there is more OH so again this uh, second OH also can be ionized so this will extract this second proton also and here then the mechanism will be like this this will be dianion and dianion so both the anion are electron repelling in nature so this uh, hydride ion can be more rapidly transferred to the molecule of this another molecule of like this benzaldehyde and we will get phco or negative and ph c o negative h h here this is already uh, in the carboxylate form so here this cannot provide proton but yes this will get proton from the solvent and solvent is always like uh, this can get from like from water and this after getting water again this will provide alkali OH ion hydroxide ion so because medium is uh, alkaline so OH ion may be there right so it will be converted into pH COH and here CH2 so this is the benzyl alcohol this is benzoate so there are possibility of these two uh, formation of these two oxygen ion in the first step and then the second step is slow so this is the rate limiting step the second one and in the rate limiting step total molecules are this is the second molecule of uh, benzaldehyde this is the first molecule of benzaldehyde having hydroxide ion added so this is the rate of reaction the rate uh, will be like k and this phcho there are two molecules of this and one oh negative OH negative because OH is in the added form so in the rate limiting step slow step it uh, this uh, there are three molecules are taking part so that's why this is the third order reaction and suppose that if we are considering this one this uh, the another possibility the formation of this dianion so there are total two OH ion taking part so rate will be rate will be like K and PHCHO Two and hydroxide ion two so it is depending on the uh, this is the fourth order reaction right so fourth order reaction the, the second order for the second order towards this uh, the benzaldehyde aldehyde and uh, the second order for the this hydroxide ion also so in this reaction suppose that this reaction is carried out in uh, heavy water that is a deuterium oxide so what happens because this is like solvent like water so here this uh, benzyl alcohol doesn't have any deuterium so it means this uh, this this is getting this hydride is being shifted from the this molecule aldehyde molecules not from the solvent so this is the uh, after shifting suppose that this is the hydrogen after shifting so this is not coming from solvent so this is proving that in D2O suppose that if we have uh, got suppose that uh, we have got this deuterium here so definitely it means that that is that is coming from solvent but we are not getting uh, any deuterium at the alpha position so it means this hydride is coming from the another molecule of this uh, benzaldehyde or aldehyde so this is deuterium effect is uh, proving this
Now there are other examples of Kanizawa reaction and this is formaldehyde, two moles of formaldehyde in presence of alkali, strong alkali. This will be uh, one molecule will be uh, reduced and this is reduction is like uh, you can write at CH2OH. The carbon number is same. This so one carbon aldehyde. This is also one carbon aldehyde methanol and another molecule will be oxidized into carboxylic acid again the carbon number is same now this is another example this is furfural this is furfural and furfural and this is uh, heterocyclic compound for uh, and uh, this is uh, two carbo carboxaldehyde furan two carboxaldehyde furfural and the two moles in presence of uh, strong alkali the, the one will be reduced another will be oxidized so this is the uh, furfuryl alcohol furfuryl alcohol and this is uh, sodium salt of furfuroic um, acid furfuroic acid this is sodium furfurate or sodium salt of furfuroic acid So this is another example of uh, the Canizaro reaction here this is aliphatic aldehyde having this is alpha carbon this is the main group and this is alpha carbon at alpha carbon there is no hydrogen so this also can give the Canizaro reaction and here also uh, the two moles of this and uh, in presence of alkali strong alkali the one will be reduced to the uh, primary alcohol primary alcohol and the another will be oxidized to sodium salt of carboxylic acid and uh, when both the aldehyde groups are in the same molecule then there will be the internal or intramolecular Canizaro reaction means two aldehyde group in the same molecule so one group will be reduced so this is the reduction here and one group will be oxidized so this is the oxidation and sodium salt of carboxylate so we will get this and this is glyoxal and here we will get this sodium salt of glycolic acid or glycolate sodium glycolate here and this is the another example of internal or intramolecular canizaro reaction in which we are seeing that one is aldehyde group but this is uh, you can say uh, this is alpha keto aldehyde alpha keto aldehyde and this is alpha keto this is this is not aldehyde group one is aldehyde one is ketonic group but here there is no alpha hydrogen here also so here this also will give the Canizaro reaction and here this uh, aldehyde group because this is terminal this can be oxidized only this will be converted into the carboxylic acid or sodium salt of carboxylic acid and another group which is ketonic that will be reduced into the alcoholic group and that is the because this is ketone so we will get the uh, secondary alcohol this two degree alcohol and uh, this is the example of crossed Canizaro reaction when the aldehydes having no alpha hydrogens are a uh, different molecule or different compound this is benzaldehyde this is formaldehyde they, these two are different molecule so of different compound so they also give uh, can go also give the Canizaro reaction and here whenever we are taking this uh, formaldehyde so this is very small molecule very less crowded and this is highly active so uh, very oxidizable uh, molecule so this will be oxidized always so oxidation if there one molecule in the cross Canizaro reaction one molecule is formaldehyde so always that will be oxidized and the second aldehyde whatever it is that will be reduced so this is benzaldehyde another molecule so that will be reduced so there will be reduction of this and oxidation always oxidation of this formaldehyde because this is a smaller molecule very much oxidizable so this will be oxidized here Now this is the another example of crossed Canizaro reaction. Here this is uh, furfural 
and this is formaldehyde again because formaldehyde is one molecule so this will be oxidized so there will be always oxidation of this formaldehyde and there will be reduction of the another molecule which is furfural so this will there will be reduction so this these will be the product of this crossed canizaro reaction